The Honorable Minister of Indigenous and Northern Relations. Madam Speaker, volunteers are the heart of many boards, clubs, and community organizations. And today I'd like to recognize one of Agassiz's finest, Mary Ellen Clark of Nipua. Since her children became active in school and sports, Mary Ellen has been a dedicated volunteer and the backbone of many organizations and committees. Her success and accomplishments have been many, earning awards and recognition for outstanding contributions to her community. After a breast cancer diagnosis and treatment in 1995, Mary Ellen became involved in the local cancer support group. It later developed into the palliative care program in Nipoa, where she works today as the volunteer coordinator and recently was recognized by Cancer Care Manitoba for 20 years of service. Mary Ellen has been very involved with the Nipoa Natives Junior A Hockey Club and was billet coordinator for 10 years, a billet mom for 15 years, and it always had three players in her home for six months of the year. Throughout the years, she has provided a home away from home for 75 players and still hears from many of them. In 2010, Mary Ellen was named RBC Local Hockey Leader and recognized in the Hockey Hall of Fame in Toronto. In 2012, she received the Nikoa Sportsman of the Year Award and was also the recipient of the Queen Elizabeth II Diamond Jubilee Medal. Mary Ellen has had a significant role and fantastic success as the Lottery Chairman for the Nikon District Medical Committee. Since its beginning in 2005, she has helped raise $1.2 million for the Nipoa Personal Care Home and the Medical Clinic. The clinic just celebrated the addition of the new facility, which now accommodates eight doctors. She continues to be a member of the Medical Recruitment Committee for Nipoa and area. I've only listed a very few of Mary Ellen's extensive list of awards and community involvement. She has made a huge difference to the community which she lives in and has touched many lives in significant ways. I'd like to share my personal appreciation to Mary Ellen for her dedicated passion to my friend Diane, for being by her side through both her fights with cancer and providing comfort and peace in her final days. Mary Ellen, you're an inspiration to all who know you and love you. Madam Speaker, I'd ask that all members of this House join me in recognizing Mary Ellen for all she has accomplished and for being a dedicated volunteer in her community and our province. Thank you.